Welcome to BTI, that's Bible Training Institute. We open the scriptures every week, line upon line, precept upon precept, here a little and there a little. Study with us and learn how to know God as a close, intimate, and personal friend, and learn what is soon to come upon this world. You can be unafraid because God has placed everything in His Word. Amen. And it should make you want to read the prophet more. So that you can better understand. See, you would have, I would have read this and never known it was in the Word of God. When I, when I read that, it made me say, man, this is in the Word of God somewhere. I want to see it. Amen. Amen. When you study like this, the spirit of prophecy leads you back to the Bible. Yeah. And then together, a man has a foundation firm that no one can shake if he puts his hand in Jesus. Let's look at uh, Genesis 1. Because we're looking at the beginning. This is the foundation. In Genesis 1, notice what the Bible says. Someone says, well, how are we going to see that man was clothed with life? What the, hold on. Let's read the Bible. Genesis 1. Look what the Bible says in verse 26. Genesis 1 and verse 26. And when you get there, let me know by saying amen. Amen. Let's look at verse 1. The Bible says in Genesis 1, verse 26, And God said, Let us make what? Man. Let us make man. How are we going to make man? What does the Bible say? Make man how? In our image. Make man in what? Our image. image. I put it on the board. Our image. You write your notes, put man image of God. Put that. So we make man in our image. The Bible goes on to say, after our what? Likeness. Now what does it mean by likeness? What does it mean by likeness? So that we look like how he look. Yes. Same image, same look like. Then the Bible says, and let him have dominion. And he talks about his dominion. Verse 27 says, so God created man in his own image. In the image of God created he him. Male and female created he them. So if I want to know what man looked like before sin, all I need to do is look at God. Yes. Because the Bible says man was in God's image. Man was in God's likeness. Is God naked? No. If God was naked and uncovered, when God is naked of artificial clothing, but he's naked and unashamed because God is covered. In fact, go to Psalms 104 and let's notice this. Look at Psalms 104 and let's let the Bible tell us something very important about our God. In Psalms 104... Notice what the Bible says in Psalms 104. We want to begin in verse 1, Psalms 104 and verse 1. Now follow what we're doing. The prophet says that Adam and Eve were clothed with a light that covered their nakedness so that they had no artificial clothing, but light covered them, and they were unashamed because they were still covered. So in their original form, dress reform, listen to me carefully, the first basic of dress reform. Make sure you watch this entire End Time Present Truth study. Simply head over to our website at www.molministry.com and click BTI on the menu bar. You'll find this study and so much more. Come and see.